హే వెల్కమ్ బ్యాక్ టు మెనీ వీడియో గైజ్ సంపత్ వాచింగ్ సంపత్ సాఫెక్స్ యూట్యూబ్ ఛానల్ అండ్ దిస్ దూఐ థర్టీన్ బై లూకస్ ఫర్ వైర్ ఐ మీన్ ద రెడ్మీ నోట్ ఫైవ్ ప్రో అండ్ వీ క్యాన్ సీ గైస్ అండ్ విత్ ఇన్ దట్ దిస్ ద లేటెస్ట్ బిల్డ్ ఐ మీన్ ద బీటా బిల్డ్ ట్వంటీ వన్ పాయింట్ వన్ టూ పాయింట్ టూ నైన్ ఫోర్ రెడ్మీ నోట్ ఫైవ్ ప్రో విల్ గెట్ ప్రాపర్ డివైస్ డీటెయిల్స్ ఇయర్ స్నాప్ డ్రాగన్ సిక్స్ థర్టీ సిక్స్ యూ క్యాన్ రీడ్ అవుట్ ఇయర్ and i have been running the cpu throttling test for last 2 minutes let's show you as you can see this is the cpu throttling test in this from i mean me i 13 the beta version for redmi note 5 pro this is the cpu throttling test maximum is 56 average is 55 minimum is 47 i also show this how the app drawer and home screen you will get and left side you will get this me volt and uh, let's see into the the geek bench scores here the single score performance and multiple as you can see the app loading time is a little bit late in this smartphone after this rom single score 281 and 522 and the kernel used here is linux 4.4.292 extended kernel 4.4 hmb old cam for redmi note 5 pro you can check out the cpu throttling test and geek bench score and here there is a bug called like this one is not going restore items if i select restore it takes 2 by 2 and it won't perform the task actually and if i press not now it's still on the notification toggle this so and there are lots of bloatware also pre-installed in this rom i have uninstalled some of them and some are still available like netflix amazon prime video ఫోన్ పే దోస్ ఆర్ ప్రీ ఇన్స్టాల్డ్ ఇన్ దిస్ రామ్ లెట్ సి వాల్ పేపర్స్ అండ్ స్టైల్ అండ్ ఇంటర్ ద సెటింగ్స్ హియర్ యూ క్యాన్ సి మోర్ దిస్ హౌ హోమ్ స్క్రీన్ అండ్ ద డిఫాల్ట్ లాంచర్ యూ గెట్ మీ వై లేటెస్ట్ లాంచర్ మీ వై థర్టీన్ వన్ సిస్టమ్ నావిగేషన్ యూ క్యాన్ చెక్అవుట్ హియర్ అండ్ హోమ్ స్క్రీన్ విత్ యాప్ డ్రైవర్ వితౌట్ యాప్ డ్రైవర్ యూ క్యాన్ సెలెక్ట్ బ్యాక్గ్రౌండ్స్ దీస్ థింగ్స్ ఆర్ ఎగ్జాక్ట్లీ సేమ్ అండ్ మైనస్ వన్ స్క్రీన్ యూ క్యాన్ అడ్జస్ట్ బిటీన్ గూగుల్ డిస్కవర్ నన్ అండ్ యాప్ వాల్ట్ అండ్ దెర్ ఆర్ సమ్ ఆఫ్ ద థింగ్స్ లైక్ డోంట్ షో టెక్స్ట్ యూజ్ ఏ ఫోర్ అండ్ టూ సెవెన్ లెవ్ విత్అట్ టెక్స్ట్ అండ్ డబల్ ట్యాప్ టు లాక్ స్క్రీన్ ఫీల్ దీస్ థింగ్స్ ఆర్ గివెన్ యూ కెన్ సిట్ ఐకామ్స్ ఆల్సో యూ కెన్ అడ్జస్ట్ విచ్ ఇస్ సేమ్ థింగ్ global icon animations and show memory status and blur app views all these things are given in this row into like let's see widgets and new 13 widgets are available no as of now it's still in beta it's a first beta build for any devices as of now only few devices got stable update of new 13 and this is uh, ported on actually and this how the settings panel will get as you can see into the my device you will get all the settings as i explained and the security status also you will get these kind of basic things connection sharing and wallpaper and personalization you will get always on display which is working fine not a problem this is how you can adjust the lock screen layout nothing new here and icons also you can change some of the themes are installed here you can adjust the icon size it's nothing new effects also same thing when you get a notification now let's move into like okay always on this panel lock screen you can adjust from here notification effect also you can change from here use app icons for notifications and power menu axis glance for me is also present as you can see charging animation also you can change here i have glow and enter the display settings you get dark theme as you can see this up and the quick settings panel is also not had been changed as of now it's still me at 12.5 type only not a 13 one and more dark options you get like this and anti flicker mode reading mode color scheme also print of options has been given as you can see advanced settings are also given in this row you can choose that's the good thing and refresh at any of this device supports only 60 hertz refresh rate and glow mode font settings these are given and 
into like sound and vibration also it's same as anything you can enable or disable the vibration haptic feedback from here and also select the strength of the vibration feedback and notification and control center is still the same you get only two of these style new version and old one and in battery settings we have some of the options like as you can see you can adjust from balanced and performance you can change from here ok and you can even choose save battery if you want you can even turn on the ultra saver mode this is a new thing we have 13 style i'll keep it in balance if you want a performance mode you can adjust from here it really make difference means yes it will make difference into the app settings you get all this settings app lock is pre-installed in the additional settings you will get this memory extension 2 GB of memory extension is given in this room it's a mere 12.5 enhanced version settings and into the special features you get some of the options like slide bar this is very useful as you can see from here if I tap the slide bar will be enabled this is a MIUI 13 style you can optimize it. I mean you can use any apps from here for example let me open gallery as you can see like this it will work this very cool feature slide bar I mean side bar front camera assistant is given floating windows is also given and the second space is also given which is not a problem these are always there nothing new here into screen time this is how digital well-being is there and <coughs> into the passwords and security you will get screen unlock fingerprint unlock and face unlock all are working fine not a big thing here and this is how the app to run home screen and the these things and you can use this sidebar nothing new as of now the dialer also you get me with dialer only the app loading time is little bit late in this room that's the one thing i have been noticed as of now and you'll get the ui camera i mean the nx camera is pre-installed which is working fine not a problem this is how the performance and everything i have been testing out this wrong if you are first time to this channel hit that subscribe button and also allow the bell notification by pressing the bell icon and if you like the video give it a like guys and this is how the recent apps you will get the here it's fluidity but in the settings panel and all it takes a little bit of time and this is the initial build of me 13 nothing change i have been noticed as of now if you guys see any changes do comment in the comment section below and that's always we'll meet you with another interesting video until that keep smiling bye bye for now